Hey, Ultimate fam, it's Evan from U30PS here. Today, we're getting our first look at the FlashForge Creator 4. I'm sure you noticed this impressive steel edge wooden case next to me. And yes, this is how your Creator 4 will arrive, on a custom pallet measuring 38 inches by 31 and a half inches, so it does fit through most doorways. Tools are gonna to be required for this unboxing, so I'll take my hammer here, and I'm gonna bend all the notches out straight. We are gonna speed this part up a bit, but we will keep a timer at the bottom for those interested in the real setup time. Whew, at least we know it shipped really well. Let's get a look inside. Wow. Let's get this piece of back. Wow. Look at this thing, just amazing. The premium stainless steel body looks immaculate. Seven inch touchscreen, beautiful. This beast measures approximately 33 inches by 26 and a half inches by almost 40 inches tall and weighs roughly 200 pounds due to the premium stainless steel body. I mean, look at this amazing machine. Before we get inside, we are going to unwrap it and release the gantry and extruders. These wonderful coverings off. Wow. All right, now we're going to release the gantry and extruders. All right, we've got our angle cutters and we're going to release the gantry. First, starting with the extruders. The gantry cable ties are back here behind the extruders. You wanna be very careful because there's a lot of wiring going on around here. Now that we've got all our zip ties confirmed, we wanna make sure that everything moves freely. Moving our extruders very carefully. Moving completely unobstructed. Everything looks good, we can move inside. All right, now to raise the bed, we'll go to our massive seven inch, beautiful color touchscreen. Platform up. And this beautiful seven inch touchscreen is moving this giant platform. And move it up to the top so we can access the accessories. There we go, we're gonna set this off to the side. Have some extra parts in here. We'll grab our, our toolkit and our filament. Now we can lower this platform and see this giant bed. Immediately notice the large filament storage container. Compared to the Creator 3s, the Creator 4s is much improved. It holds one kilogram spools and a two kilogram spool. Wow, just look at this build platform. The Creator 4 has a build platform of 400X by 350Y and 500 in Z or Z. It is supported by four vertical rods and driven by dual lead screws. To start the filament loading process on the seven inch touchscreen, we will hit load and left extruder and HT and then PLA. We have PLA here. We will insert it into our print head until it is grabbed by the extruder and pulled into the machine. And now what you've all been waiting for, we've transitioned the Creator 4 from the studio to its rightful place in the workshop. And now let's see how this beauty prints. 
Thanks to our friends at Fortis 3D for sending us some of their Ignis PLA for testing. Here we are printing a batch of load bearing brackets. The Creator Force heated chamber promotes layer adhesion to produce the strongest parts possible. And look at that, with a little flex, parts slide right off the build plate. These brackets turned out amazing, with only minor tweaking of the FastForge PLA profile to suit the high performance Ignis PLA. You gotta love that powder PEI finish on the bottom as well. Now, this is a feature I'm excited for. Quick change tool heads. Using the Creator 4's interchangeable independent dual extruders, one can simply remove the entire tool head, including direct drive assembly, and then attach another that is suitable for current printing operations. Here we have the HT, the HS, and the F extruders. Both the HT and HS extruders feed 1.75 millimeter filament while the F extruder feeds 2.85 millimeter filament for increased performance with flexible filament. You can find more information on the specs of each extruder in the link in description. We will now install the F extruders, as well as the spool holders, which will help by shortening the filament path. Vase mode TPU, anyone? I think so. The Creator 4 handles difficult filament with ease. As you can see, these came out great. The print quality is excellent, and that is to be expected. This printer is without a doubt a professional quality 3D printer. For more information, you can click the link in the bio or contact sales at u3dps.com. Until next time, have an ultimate day.